Welcome to Tally Help videos. In this video, you will understand the process of getting the latest IRN information for the vouchers for which e-invoices are generated or cancelled using Tally Prime's offline export, some other software or directly on the NIC portal and update them with IRN and QR code in Tally Prime. Sometimes you may have generated or cancelled IRN for vouchers using offline export, some other software or directly on the NIC portal and you may want to import the IRN information for those vouchers in Tally Prime. Tally Prime provides you with a facility called Get IRN Info using which you can import the latest IRN ACK number and ACK date along with the QR code from e-invoice system to the vouchers. The facility is provided in e-invoice report in relevant sections where you may want to fetch the latest IRN information from the e-invoice system to update the vouchers. Let us see how to use the facility in different scenarios. Open the e-invoice report. Press Alt G, type and select e invoice. Press Enter. The pending section may be having vouchers for which IRN is generated or cancelled using some other software or directly on the NIC portal. You can update the latest information in the voucher in just a few seconds. Select the voucher. Click Get IRN Info and accept the screen. Now enter your NIC login credentials and press Enter. Tally Prime will exchange data with NIC, fetch the latest IRN information and update it in the voucher. As you can see, the information has been fetched and the voucher has moved to the IRN generated section. In the exported section, there will be vouchers for which JSON file is generated and uploaded to the NIC portal for IRN generation or cancellation. You can use Get IRN Info in order to fetch the latest IRN information and update the voucher with QR code. If the system does not have the internet connection and you want to update the information in the voucher, you can use the facility Manually Update IRN Info. Enter the IRN information acquired from the portal in the voucher. As you can see, the voucher has moved to the IRN update without QR code section under IRN generated. Now, select the voucher and use Get IRN Info whenever the internet connection is available. As you can see, the voucher now has a QR code. Using the Get IRN Info facility, you can also fetch the latest IRN information and update the vouchers in Marked as IRN Cancelled section under IRN Cancelled. Once you do that, the voucher will move to the IRN Cancelled from e-invoice system section. 
there may be a situation in which a voucher will be rejected by e-invoice system during online generation in Tally Prime. You may have generated the e-invoice offline later. In such cases, drill down to the rejected by e-invoice system. Select the voucher. Click Get IRN Info and complete the process. The latest IRN information will be fetched and get updated in the voucher and the voucher will move to the IRN generated section. And if you have cancelled the e-invoice on the portal, the voucher will move to the IRN cancelled section when you get IRN info and update the voucher. You can also get IRN info for the vouchers under the voucher information mismatch with QR code section. For example, if you have created the sales voucher for a party and completed the e-invoicing process, Later, if some modifications are done, the voucher will move to the Voucher Information Mismatch with QR Code section in e-invoice report. In such scenario, you can get the latest status and details as per NIC portal using Get IRN Info and modify your books accordingly to match with NIC portal. Once you do that, the transaction will move out of the voucher information mismatch with QR code section to IRN generated or cancelled section as applicable. Or if the books are correct and you intend to cancel the e-invoice, use the cancel IRN option. As you saw, Tally Prime provides you with the flexible facility to fetch the latest IRN information from e-invoice system and update the vouchers. Moreover, your e-invoice report gets updated as the vouchers move to the respective sections once the latest IRN information is fetched from e-invoice system using Get IRN. Mm -hmm.